So I didn't get any sleep last night, but I still wanted to make sure that I was getting a video up for you guys today. So we're going to be drafting a team, maybe a 12-0 team. I don't even know if I'll be playing 12 games between now and the uh, the start of MLB 20 and everything, man. But we're here. We're drafting a team going for 212 or more likes on the video. Subscribe if y'all are new on the road to 45 thousand subscribers thank you guys so much for 44 thousand y'all are insane i appreciate the support every single day i love you guys continue to make my day better and just overall make my day every single day so thank you so much for that comment down below maybe your thoughts on the developer stream yesterday a lot of cool information man those red diamonds uh prime cards award cards which i think have some insane card there's just so much going on and uh, i'm excited just for everything, I I can't I can't pick one specific thing out, man. The three uh, the three batter rule in BR ranked seasons, H having an opener like uh, so much to talk about. We'll maybe save that for another day or something, or maybe during the gameplay. I don't know. Either way, we're gonna draft a team. Feel free to follow on any of those social medias and all that good stuff. I'm interested to see how my gameplay goes. Not having uh not having any sleep. Willie Mays in that first round. Uh, I'm gonna do. It may be a bad idea, but I'm going Shohei Otani right there. So, draft strategy going to be different. On the stream, I believe they said that there are only two diamond rounds now instead of three. But I think they also said that there's two common rounds, too. I'm pretty sure. Something like that, man. So, I have a feeling that... Uh, I have a feeling that... Oh, man, who do I want? I'm going to do Cepeda. I have a feeling that Battle Royale is going to just play a lot differently... In MLB 20 than it has uh, in any other year. We can do Vizcayeno in the pen. Yo, we got our common around so early on in this draft. Man, that's kind of crazy. I'm not used to that. I'm not used to that at all, bro. Miguel Sano or Adalberto Mondesi. So, Sano, I'm batting 455. Okay, wait. Am I better with this live series card? I'm gonna... Uh, I'm gonna go Sano here because I want the power, but... I don't know. I thought I was better. Maybe it's this live series card that I have just the insane stats with Randall Gritchick right there. Uh, Brandon Morrow couldn't. Uh, I don't know about him, man. I don't know who I want. Let's just say Sir Hernandez is a switch hitter. We got a lot of righties in the uh, in the lineup. Calvin Herrera go to righty in the pen. There's a guaranteed lefty in the pen. Let's just do our final starting pitcher, Tyler Chatwood and Nico Goodrum. I love this card. Michael Givens. Oh, man. That's tough, man. That's tough. I'm going to go Carson. Ke oh, wait. I, why did I do that? I just I actually just screwed up big time. I'm pretty sure. We're going to get a diamond and a gold round for, for bullpen. I feel like now. Oh, man. I might have actually screwed up. I should have gotten the lefty in that other round. Wow. I... It's okay. This this might be my last draft. Eh, maybe we'll have one more. This might be my last draft of uh of MLB 19 though. So you never know. All right. Gold round, silver round. I want to replace maybe left field, maybe second, maybe catcher. So let's see. I could put DD at catcher, or pff, I could put DD at short, or I could do Yasmani at catcher. I'm gonna go Yasmani at catcher. I like that decision right there. Colby Rasmus. Power hitter, speedster, Juan Ligares. Jed Lowry's been a beast for me. We might put him a second. I also like Cesar Hernandez, though. Todd Father for that power versus lefty. So, Yasmani, we're going to put him at catcher. I'm going to do, yeah, do Jed Lowry at second. And for my lineup, I'm probably just going to do Miguel Sano, uh, Shaw. Shohei Otani here, Willie Mace here, Nico Goodrum. Oh yeah, we we want some pay to here, then Nico Goodrum, and then Yasmani. Oh, that's perfect, man. That's a beautiful lineup. Woo! -wee! There we go. Let me know what you guys think of that lineup here. I'm I, I'm thinking it's pretty sick. I like it. Uh, Miguel Sano, not a lot of vision. He's gonna do good, hopefully against a common or a bronze. That might be a little bit different. In uh in. MLB 20, but we'll have to wait and see. Zach Burton, my go-to lefty in the pen. Kelby, my go-to righty. Here we go. Let's go ahead and uh, 
and try to be 1-0 with this team. We're playing the Maryland Terrapins. Our opponent has Jock Peterson and 99 Gary Carter, Freddie Freeman, Gary Sanchez, Mike Trout, Rubnet Odor, Paul DeYoung, Aristides, Aquino. Wow. That's a nutty lineup. Oh, my goodness. Not a weak spot in there. That's actually an insane BR lineup. I really like that. Valdez Fromber on the mound. We got Carson Fulmer on the mound. We're the white team hoping to jump out to an early lead. Start off 1-0 with this team, hopefully. One thing that I will say, okay, so I already mentioned that I didn't get any sleep last night. And if you guys watched yesterday's video, it was my final game versus Otaxi. And that was played a week ago. It was literally played on Sunday, March, what was that? First, second, dude, I don't know dates, but it was, it was last week. It was on Sunday. So I have not played MLB The Show in a week. I've not played the game in a week, and I'm interested to see how it goes and if I feel rusty at all. Miguel Sano, not a bad start. I had two whiffs, okay? I was 0-2. I swung and missed way out in front of two off-speed pitches here on all-star difficulty. And then that's that's not a bad way to end the at-bat. Willie Mays coming up. If he brings in a righty to face Mays, we have... Did I put Nico Goodrum after him, who has a lot of power versus righties? I hope I did. Raleigh Fingers coming in to pitch. Willie Mays grounding out. I'm pretty sure there was a Cy Young version of Raleigh Fingers that I saw on the dev stream. And I'm so excited for that card because it's going to be in the game early on. And I don't remember how to get it. I think I, I'm pretty sure they did show how to get it. I hope they did. And uh, I felt like it wasn't super hard to get. Which makes me sad because Raleigh Fingers has always been one of my toughest relievers to face. But it also makes me happy because I really want to get him on my team as early as possible. Oh, Freddie Freeman. Good to know my pitching has not uh, has not lost a beat. We're still in mid-season form. We're still in our prime for pitching. That's a two-on base hit for Freddie Freeman. 110 off the bat on the changeup down the middle. Gary Sanchez coming up. I'm hoping that we don't allow a run. And striking out Gary Sanchez. I think he swung when the ball was in the glove. Orlando Cepeda coming up. Facing Raleigh Fingers. Top of the second. Looking to hop out to a lead. I'm swinging at everything right now. I have no patience. Cepeda! Swing it at everything. Can't pay off right there. Uh, that's okay. Yasmani Grandal caps off a 1-2-3 inning for us here in the top of the second, but that gives me hope for the top of the third. I'm hoping that we don't allow any runs. We're facing Mike Trout, Kelvin Herrera on the mound, looking for a 1-2-3 bottom of the second. Oh, no. Whoa! 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 What a catch! Paul DeYoung for the 1 2 3, bottom of the second. I got to score here. If I don't score in the top of the third inning, I forecast a loss in my future. Jad Lowry starts the inning with a bang. There we go. Single up the middle. Oh, man. Uh, Okay, in my defense, at first I thought I was under it, and then just the way the camera changed for the ball off the bat, it looked like a no-doubter type thing, and then it was obviously an easy fly ball, so. I didn't think, I thought, and then I didn't think. Colby Rasmus, pinch hitter, straight to that right fielder for out number two. One more batter here in the top of the third. The good news is it's Miguel Sano. He has the opportunity, the power the will, the determination, the pride, the something rather to put us in the lead. He extends the inning though. We got guys in the corners now looking to score. And he's intentionally walking Willie Mays. That makes me sad. I'm not going to lie. It makes me sad. Shohei Otani coming in. I'm assuming a lefty. Yeah, it's going to be a lefty. Billy Wagner. Please tell me it's not 99. Okay, it's 78. That's a little bit better. Still a tough card to face, especially lefty v lefty. And I swing at the first pitch. I screwed up. Base is loaded. Two down. We can't do anything. Let's try to have a scoreless bottom in the third. That's not good. One down here. Bottom of the third inning. 53 speed. Pinch hitter. Winning run on first base. Jock Peterson striking out on the 0-2. Count one out away from extra innings. Gary Carter grounding out on our way to the fourth inning. Free baseball coming up. Willie Mays. 
with a solo home run to lead off the fourth inning. Let's go. That makes me happy. And that's a base hit. I didn't expect it to be, but I'll take it following that Willie Mays home run. Yasmani Grandal. I can never tell in Fenway because it looks like it's going to be caught. Yeah, it is. Okay. Jed Lowry. This is one that seems like it's... Oh, I didn't mean to send him. I was going to say, this is one that seems like it's going to be a home run off the bat just based on that camera angle change. That's the second time already, but it ends up just being a fly ball. And that's going to end the fourth inning, not before we take the lead. Zach Britton looking for some more outs, looking to save the game for us. Freddie Freeman, Gary Sanchez, Mike Trout. It's not going to be easy. Freddie Freeman striking out, out number one. And Gary Sanchez striking out for out number two. And Mike Trout grounds out. We win the game 1-0 with the No Sleep team. If you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to leave a like, subscribe, comment, anything down below. Feel free to follow on any of those social medias, all that good stuff. I'll see you next time. Thank you as always for watching. Hope you all have a fantastic rest of your day. Wait, why did I think Willie Mays had the home run? Dude, I don't know. Peace out.